Hey, what's up there, YouTube? I have a video today showing you how to really take control of your um, downloaded launcher because most people don't actually like their regular launcher that it comes with, like Moto Blur, TouchWiz, HTC Sense, stuff of that nature. And a lot of people ask me from my videos how I have my scrolling set in different ways and stuff like that. I will tell you it's not because I am rooted, it's just because of Go Launcher. You don't have to use Go Launcher, you can use an app of your choice like ADW Launcher, Launcher Pro, I believe there's one called like Zemer Launcher or something like that. All that kind of stuff. And here is my home screen. As you can see I hid the status the status bar. I have a suave icon theme, very simplistic. I'm still looking for a better clock widget that goes with my setup. And then my scrolling is different, it switches every time. Very nice. It's not doing the actual cool ones though, I don't know why, oh there we have one. Also, it's like that for me, for for me, for my app drawer. As you can see, it's set on random, so every time I scroll, it is something different. Definitely love that. Anyways, I'm gonna show you how to do that right now. You wanna go back, click on this button, go into preferences and from here you have a whole list of things you can do you can go to where did I just go into screen settings you can choose to hide your status bar which by the way it is actually kind of easier to use now because I can scroll from anywhere in the screen and it will come down just like that oh shoot <laughs> There we go. Um, you know, back to preferences. Screen settings, you have a whole list of things you can do. You can change your grid size, dock row, loop mode, theme settings. You have, as you can see, my theme is Suave Icons. You can set up wallpaper. You can change the dock style. Um, you can do a bunch of stuff. Also, here's the thing people ask me about the most. The switching how the transitions were. All you do is go into effect settings. You can change the desktop transmission, transition. Enter exit transition into the app drawer and transitions in the app drawer normally oops didn't want to exit that and all that good stuff really all you want to do is go into preferences find stuff that you like most and change it to your liking really it's not too hard and when you do that you have your own nice little simplistic well, if you like that anyway, some people like their screen more clustered than I do. Simplest get desk screen. Oh, you can add application shortcuts by just going like that. Go into applications, stuff like that. You can obviously just hold and get into widgets, go widget, stuff like that set up screens more and all that good stuff also if you don't like as you can see in my other videos I have for my last uh, desk I had it wasn't really a theme it was my own custom icons so what you do is you just hold on the app you want to change 
click on to custom icon and it'll take you to your gallery and you'll find what you want crop it to what you want and you're good to go that's about it guys sorry if that wasn't as in depth as you like there wasn't a whole lot to tell really it's all self explanatory so I just wanted to show you where to go from after you downloading it because apparently people don't know if they ask me for the video and that is about it guys also one thing I recommend is downloading the OTA update my battery life has been amazing after getting it usually it lasts about 12 hours after this if you use light to moderate use it should last you over two days easy like this 20% should last me until tomorrow till I don't know probably about 12 noon or something like that but yeah right now it's been on for one day seven hours and 36 minutes it fixed a lot of stuff if you don't get that they are coming out with the actual update pretty soon well hopefully soon they haven't really confirmed when they just confirmed that there is an update coming anyways guys thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel and if you want any more videos just message me if I don't know how to do it I'll learn and then show you guys and that's about it. Thanks for watching guys and I will talk to you guys later. Peace.